Zania Makarova from Russia. Eighth in the world's last year, just 18 years of age. Setting up a combination, triple toe loop, kept it long and low. Gives her plenty of speed for the second jump. Perfect. Triple loop. Yeah. Still a lot of height, but landed it fine. Difficult entry too off those travelling three turns. And a double axle. We saw Mao Asada, one of the contenders for gold, who's been on earlier on, go for triple axle, but it was downgraded. Very good indeed. We saw last year that this young lady's got immense talent and she's got some extra composure in the last 12 months. She's going to be a contender again. What a delight she is to watch. Senia Makarova from St. Petersburg. Yeah, that was a sensational short program. She really did tick all the boxes. Level four on two of the spins, just that last spin, level three, but apart from that, very, very good. Great combination at the beginning. Good technique through that. She doesn't get an awful lot of height on the jumps, but what she does do is maintain the speed throughout the jump, which gives her a really good running edge and a feel of control at the end of the jump. The parents are both figure skating trainers and she moved to America to follow their careers and has built one herself, maybe right to the very top of the tree. Super personality. Here's that triple toe at the beginning. You see, she doesn't get a lot of height on that, just about makes three turns. But what that does do is give her plenty of speed for that second triple toe loop. Big combination, base value, 8.2 there. Traveling three turns into the triple loop, no problem with the rotation and good control on the way out. Wonderful shots here. And the judges on the footwork looking for difficult turns and steps throughout. And a really hard entry into that camel. First part of the combination spin. Look at that for expression. Well, the last couple of years, it's been a lock-in for the Far East, hasn't it? <laughs> yes. Women's figure skating. And maybe we've seen a skater here who could break that. Maybe not this year. Even though Assad has not skated up to her best form, still got the phenomenal Kim Yuna and Mao Asada to come. Mikiando to come. 
Well, after the Olympics, the Russians, uh, the Russian Federation were told they had to shake things up and uh, be more competitive, certainly for looking ahead to Sochi. And this is just what the doctor orders as far as they're concerned. Kenny Rukovitsin, who coaches her in St. Petersburg. She also does some coaching in the Hackensack in the States. Looking up, should go into the lead. Sixty-one, sixty-two. The judges have gone with it. A new season's best. Still the final group to come, but Senia Makarova into the lead at the moment.